Hello all, welcome to this session. In this session, I'm going to answer software testing interview question 228. That is explain error guessing with an example. Let me answer. So what is error guessing? So error guessing falls under the test design techniques. Under test design techniques, there are different categories of test design techniques like uh, black box test design techniques, experience based test design techniques and structure based test design techniques. Okay, if I expand all of them, okay, all of the techniques. Okay, you see this uh, type of test design techniques fall under the black box. These two fall under the experience based. This four fall under the structure based. So where does this error guessing test design technique fall? It falls under the experience based test design technique. Okay, so error guessing is one of the experience based test design technique. So what exactly is this error guessing then? So the experienced software testers who already have tested similar kind of applications in their earlier experience, if they are given a similar type of application now, they can easily guess the errors, okay? In the new application, the brand new application that uh, they have been presented for testing, since they already have an experience of testing similar kind of application in the earlier days or in their past, they can easily guess the defects in the latest or new software given for testing guys, okay? So that's what, for example, if a tester is there, the tester has already tested amazon.com, okay? Now he completed testing, he or she completed testing and later at after some days or some years, the same tester who has tested amazon.com earlier is presented with flipkart.com, okay? Another e-commerce application or any other e-commerce application he or she has been presented. So this particular tester already has an experience of testing similar kind of e-commerce application. So what the tester can do is in very less time, this particular tester can find out the areas in the application, guess the areas in the application where there is a possibility of the defects, yes. okay? That a fresh, fresh tester cannot do that, okay? The experienced tester can do that, guys, okay? So for this, an example is, for example, if you already tested some e-commerce application and suddenly uh, you, you got a project of an, another e-commerce application, and if you have to guess an error, so maybe since I already tested many e-commerce applications, I'll simply go to the register account, and uh, I know that telephone number or email address is always a problem. So let me try with the telephone by entering some alphabets into the telephone and click on continue. It's accepted. Telephone number is accepted if I'm giving alphabets, guys. This what kind of, uh, you know, right? This kind of experience I got from my previous application. When I tested previous application, same thing may have happened. Uh, there also the telephone number was accepting alphabets. There I reported a defect. With that experience, suddenly directly I came to the new application, register account page, uh, and in very less time, I gave the alphabets in telephone, thinking that, guessing that there is a possibility of defect in this case, and defect is still there, right? Defect is there. I'm able to find the defect because of my error guessing capabilities, okay? So this is what is error guessing, guys, with an example. So hope, guys. So hope, guys, you understood what exactly is error guessing in this session. So that's all for this session. In the next session, I'm going to answer another software testing interview question for you. Till then, see you, bye-bye.